Caitlin. And Caitlin Clark's WNBA debut with the Fever is marred by unwelcome past. On Tuesday night, Caitlin Clark, a former standout player for Iowa women's basketball, made her WNBA debut with the Indiana Fever. Unfortunately, despite a stellar performance by Sun Big Alyssa Thomas, Clark's 20-point debut did not translate into victory as the Fever lost 92-71. Clark's performance also happened to land on the wrong side of history. According to Talia Goodman, Clark's nine mistakes on Tuesday night surpassed the record for most turnovers in a debut game in the WNBA. It makes sense that she is struggling. Ultimately, it was her maiden WNBA match, and she faced one of the most formidable teams in the league. The Connecticut Sun made it to the 2023 playoff semifinals and then started the 2024 WNBA season. The skilled New York Liberty team defeated the third-seeded Sunday March 1st. Still, Connecticut made a tremendous comeback in their first game against the Fever. Alyssa Thomas, a 2023 MVP candidate, continued her excellent performance from before. Thomas finished with 13 points. 10 rebounds, and 13 assists to record a triple-double. She wasn't the only person who was cruel to Clark and the Fever. Four additional players scored in double figures for Connecticut. With 20 points, Dewana Bonner led the team, Tyasha Harris and Dijanai Carrington each added 16 points. With 10 points, Rachel Banham completed the Sun scoring. In spite of her turnover problem, Indiana's Caitlin Clark led the squad with 20 points and 3 assists. Melissa Smith scored 13 points and pulled down 9 rebounds, almost achieving a double-double. Former 2023 first overall pick Aaliyah Boston gave one of the night's most unexpected performances. Boston played 29 minutes and finished with just 4 points and 6 rebounds. As the Fever Center enters a new age, the Star Center will undoubtedly find her footing alongside Clark. Fever hopes to iron out the wrinkles and succeed in 2024. When they parked Caitlin Clark alongside Aaliyah Boston and the other players who contributed to the club, the Indiana Fever had great expectations. Clark may have had the greatest collegiate basketball career ever, and the Fever should benefit from her explosive offensive talent. Over the course of her four years with the Iowa women's basketball team, Clark broke too many records to keep track of. Most significantly, she broke the marks held by Pete Maravich and Kelsey Plum to become the NCAA's all-time top scorer. Additionally, after going 9 for 20 against LSU in the Elite Eight, she surpassed Diana Taurasi for the most points in the NCAA tournament. Throughout the entire season, the standout guard demonstrated her offensive skill. Throughout the 2023-24 campaign, Clark averaged 31.6 points, 8.9 assists, and 7.4 rebounds per game. She has been likened to greats like Sabrina Ionescu and Stephen Curry because of her extraordinary deep-range shooting skills. But as the Sun game on Tuesday night shown, she will not have an easy time succeeding. However, there is one thing Clark would never do, give up. The star will probably start working right away and get better for the next game. The WNBA matches between her and the Fever won't get any easier. On Thursday, Indiana is getting ready to play the New York Liberty, the runners-up in the championship. Clark and her group will undoubtedly be prepared and eager to compete.